Moving to London from Australia was really daunting. I had only travelled here twice when I was really young. And with COVID, I couldn't really check out the university or anything beforehand. So I just got on a plane by myself, came over. It was definitely really intimidating. But how I handled the situation, um, I'm really proud of because it definitely, I guess, opened me up to new opportunities. I tried different things and because of how challenging it was, it made me who I am today. Aussie people are a lot more laid back and care a lot less about reputation and what's expected of them. Whereas I feel like British people are more um, wary about what other people will think and how it's going to like tarnish their image, what they do, what they say. Um, so overall, I've like found that Australians are a lot more easygoing, laid back. However, both have their like good, you know, like attributes because I feel like the British are more um, work, hustle and um, uh, are more like long term, whereas Australians are more like living in the moment. Shopping in London is way better than Australia. So Australia, I think, has got more of a focus on sustainability um, and basics, um, which is nice. I've got quite a few basics from Australian brands like Cook Eye, but there's only so much you can do. And coming over here, it's really opened my eyes up to different fashion. There's a lot more vintage fashion, especially with designer, which I love. And I feel like People are more expressive with their clothing, so there's less of the basic boring top and jeans outfits. My favorite accessory is my Fendi baguette, just because I got it as a graduation present because I wanted to be like Perry Bradshaw in the big city. Um, I've pinned on these little flowers just because I do feel like it is a boring bag without it. Um, but I just love it. I love, you know, the feeling I get when wearing it because I do channel my inner carry and it's just such a versatile piece and just goes with my collection of clothes really well. This coat here was my grandmother's when she died. She passed it down to me. I'm obsessed with it. I literally wear this all the time in winter and I'm so upset it's getting sunny because it means I have to find a new coat. But um, it's absolutely amazing. Whenever I wear it, I think of her and I, you know, try and embody who she as is or was as a woman. Um, so the confidence and all that and this is my newest piece. I picked it up on Portobello Road um, Just recently and it's John Galliano for Christian Dior Lambskin coat and I'm obsessed with it um, I love the fact that you can find pieces like this in London and you can wear it in London and someone would actually appreciate it So that's yeah, definitely my newest obsession